What would you do if you could grow an inch instantly, if you could run faster or hear better? What, what would you do if you could change the way that you looked just by taking two round sphere looking things to your temple and burning them? Would you do it? What about the fact that these spheres just kind of showed up one day and nobody really knows where they're from or why they're there? Burning Midnight by Will McIntosh is about this exact thing. This book introduces 17-year-old Sully, who is a quiet young man who sells spheres of different colors at a flea market for money. Uh, Sully isn't anyone special, uh, but he he was known for finding a very rare sphere. It was a uh, cherry red. He was offered a lot of money for it and uh, only to be robbed by a man named uh, Alex Holliday, a businessman who collects and uses his spheres for a uh, personal gain. Uh, it takes two spheres, right? You put them to your temples and the color drains from them and then you get whatever ability um, that same color pair gives you. Uh, better eyesight, strength, better looks, you name it. Soli meets this girl, her name is Hunter. She uh, is a hunter of <laughs> rare spheres and uh, which she sells for money. Um, Hunter has no family and scrapes by on whatever money she can make from, from selling the spheres. She and Sully eventually develop a relationship and then they decide to team up in order to search for difficult to find spheres. They both want to find a new one, a rare one. It would help them to live a better life. They don't want to burn them, they just want to sell them for a lot of money and the rare ones will sell for millions of dollars. Eventually, Sully and Hunter start looking where nobody else has looked before, and they find something big. Uh, the story is about their journey to look for the sphere's companion, and to keep it away from the hands of the man who's dis desperately trying to take it from them. Sully, Hunter, and friends have to decide what they should do with it and what it all means. This is a tale of friendship, uh, betrayal, surprise. Their journey takes them to various places and through exciting situations. Eventually, we come to find out what the spheres represent, where they come from, and what, what their purpose is. This is the book, Burning Midnight, by Will McIntosh, and I hope that you will read it.